You've heard the phrase path to citizenship before. That's actually a bit deceiving because there are quite a few paths you could take to citizenship. All of them start with achieving permanent resident status. In other words, getting your green card. It's called a green card because it's green in color, by the way. There are all sorts of avenues to apply for a green card, like marrying a U.S. citizen, seeking asylum, or working in the U.S. After you apply for permanent resident status or get that green card, U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services told us it could take anywhere from 7 to 13 months to process that application. Once you get that green card, you have to hold it anywhere from three to five years before you can apply for actual citizenship. You have to get all your documents together, pay a big price. The average application for citizenship is more than $700. Then the government processes that citizenship application, which we're told can take anywhere from six months to a year, depending on where you live. So the whole process can take between four and seven years. We were also curious if people who've been deported can still try to apply for a legal path to citizenship. ICE told us they can request permission to enter the U.S. Granted, they haven't committed serious crimes while they were here the first time. 